Hey. Welcome to the vlog. I'm Queen Shaka. King Bear. Let's get it. <clears throat> hey, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Boom. I'm Queen Sugar. And we back with another banger. Yes. Today we have a DiGiorno pizza. Hey, okay, so we have a whole journal pizza, so um, we're gonna eat it. We're gonna see who the first person, we're gonna do the contest, and we're just gonna just, what are we gonna do? I mean, if you wanna make it a contest, we can, mm -hmm. we already know why. I don't know. I'm gonna try my best, but I'm not about to choke on the pizza, so, but I'm not a food um, contest type of person. I can't um, eat a lot of food at once. He can. So, um, but I do my best. So, like I said, well, today we have a Jordan piece. We have uh, jalapenos, I have ranch, and we have barbecue. Sweet baby ranch. And we also have some veggie sauce, okay? And we're also gonna be um, answering a couple questions. So today's um, video is about, do you know us, or how do you know us, or I'm just asking some personal, a little bit of personal questions on on us. Um, just to get to know us a little bit better. Um, and you know, why we join YouTube and some things that um, you guys probably wondering in your head, but just some little things that you probably want to know. So that's what we're gonna do today. But before we do that, make sure y'all hit that like button so you can like this uh, video for us and like all our videos and go through our channel. And, um, you know, just take your time. And um, we're trying to get up to 1,000 subscribers and um, 5,000 5, watch time so we can keep going. We really love what we're doing here, um, especially during these quarantine times and everything like that. We want to really pursue this and see how far we can go. We definitely, um, you know, give all the honor and praise to uh, God upstairs so he will move our channel for us and take it slow. Um, we do everything organically. Um, we don't press any issues. We just we just have fun, you know, family things and things like that. I love to do reviews, pop up at restaurants and stuff like that, try to do different foods. So if you have any uh, restaurants in Charles County or DMV area that you want us to do, just let us know, okay? Um, also, kings and queens, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you want to join the kings and queens family okay so put that crown up on top of your head and hit that subscribe button and we can see where we can go from there okay uh oh shout out to um is it kay kaylee what's it what's the uh the youtuber's name that always uh hit us up on um yes. instagram and um youtube huh is it Kaylee and Lee. Yeah. Yeah. I have to, I have to look at it. Okay. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not good with names, but. Yeah, my my bad. Can't think of the think of the name. I know it's it's Kay, like. I think it's Kaylee and Lee. Shout out to that family. Um, you guys always come through with comments and likes and all that other good stuff like that, guys. If you come through and you like our page and you subscribe to our page and you in the comment section and you just send in all your uh, comments and your likes and your dislikes and your favorites and your uh, questions and anything like that in the comments down below. And if you have a YouTube channel, we are going to start shouting you out. No matter how big or how small, you got to start somewhere. So make sure y'all comment down below and we definitely going to... Um, Hit y'all up with, uh, um, you know, blast out. We're going to um, call y'all names out and all that stuff like that. Because we got more views, if you know this, than more likes. So y'all make sure y'all hit that like button so we can keep going, okay? Because we want to see how far this can go, okay? Yeah, we appreciate all, all the love, all the support from everyone out, outside and out and in. You know, appreciate everything we do. We keep this. We keep this going for you guys, cause you know you guys love us and support us. So we keep it coming, banger after banger. Okay. All right. So we are gonna dig into this food. 
Um, make sure y'all share this video with everybody and all the family, friends, and thank you for our family who came through and showed love and support as well, okay? Um, oh, yesterday we did the couples challenge, so if you go to the video before this one, you'll see the couples challenge. That was pretty fun. We did a lot of games. We did TikTok, which is King Bear. Um, 2, uh, 2 11 on TikTok, so make sure y'all hit us up on that. On IG, it's King Queen Sugar and King Bear. Hit us up on that. Make sure y'all underscore under Queen Sugar and uh, underscore King Bear. And um, also, Facebook is Queen Sugar and King Bear, it's the and uh, symbol in between. Um, make sure y'all hit us up on all the platforms, and we definitely want to um, show some love back. Okay. Everything will be listed in the description box below. All right. So let's dig in. Oh, check out our mugs. This is Mrs. And, and we got sweet tea in here. Mr. Sweet. We got these from Walmart. It's two in the pack for like seven bucks, something like that. So the mason jars. Okay. So are we doing a race or are we just going to eat and talk? Which one? I'm going to make it fun. I can't eat that fast, so I don't think I'll be able to do it. But we'll see what happens. So we're not going to use any knife, any fork. We're just going to rip it. Okay. 
So his birthday is September the 7th and he's 29. My birthday is on Valentine's Day. That's right, Valentine's Day. Yes, I am an Aquarius. I love the water, I love the beach, and I love just the scenery of that. And my favorite thing is to watch um, blossom or just look at is a palm tree and just the ocean view, okay? So I am an Aquarius, and my birthday is on Valentine's Day, February 14th, okay? And I'm 34 years old. Yes, my husband is 29, and I'm 34. He'll be 30 this year. Uh, make 30. I remember when I was 30, coming out there 20, going to the 30s. After you get to 30, you're old, and it's like, I'm just kidding. But um, you just feel like when you're out of your 20s, it's just like, oh my God, the numbers just are phew, phew, phew after that. All right? What is your favorite color? As you can see, color the same purple, and also like blue. Like, you know, royalty, king and queen colors. Blue, purple, gold. You know, cause you're, yourself, male, man, woman, all kings and queens. Even even our kids, you know, prince and prince, yeah, prince and princesses, all, you know, royalty, royalty colors. So make sure y'all uh, join the Kings and Queens family. And how do you do that? Subscribe! All right. My favorite color is gold. And I love blue. And I like anything that's um, sparkly and shiny. Okay. So um, those are my favorite colors. And I just love them. I like uh, dark royal colors. So yeah. What's your favorite food? The chicken and mac and cheese. What kind of chicken? Fried chicken, baked chicken, barbecue chicken. Sure. I ain't gonna say any kind, but majority any kind. Like the, you know, the flavor, and then the, there's some good fried chicken, and then plus, you know, hot sauce, and oh, that's what I say, any any kind of chicken. Because if you know, you make it, make it right, baked chicken, baked chicken is my favorite. I like that, I eat that majority of the time, but in the past years, ate, you know, a lot of fried chicken. And, you know, we're from DMV, DC, so a lot of mumbo sauce and all that with the fries and all that. And the chicken just, I think that's, some some people like, like and love pizza. My favorite food is fried chicken. I love fish. I'm a seafood lover. I like um, crab legs and shrimp. I do not like crabs because I don't like to pick it apart and it's not enough meat in it for me. Crab, crabs good. I and go, my bad, cut you off, man. It is yeah. my turn. I you knew. already said something. It's my turn. I thought you were saying like favorite food, like one favorite food. No, we no one favorite food. You, I let mm -hmm. you sit there and talk, so it's my turn. No. She, I, no, I'm saying, I thought you were saying favorite food, like food, like my favorite, you know, like one. I didn't know you were saying food. Baby, like you said chicken. chicken and macaroni and cheese. You didn't say food. You didn't say singular. You said plural. Yeah, but you, you said, oh, but continue. My bad, guy. Boy, no, no, no. Anyway. I like fried chicken, I like seafood, I love a good salad, honey, yes, I love uh, Caesar salad, I love garden salad, my favorite dressing is Caesar dressing or ranch, mm-hmm, and I love salad from Olive Garden, um, I love salads with croutons, and all the vegetables in it, and then, um, 
I like macaroni and cheese, but it depends on who made it, but I'm not a big macaroni and cheese fan. Um, pizza, I'm not a big pizza fan. I'll eat it, but I'm not like, mm, let me go get a pizza. No. Mm -mm. I want to go get some fried chicken <laughs> or a piece of fish or some seafood or something like that. Yeah, that's, that's, that's my favorite food. You got anything else you want to add to it? I said, do you have any other favorite foods that you want to eat before I'm rudely interrupted? Let's see. Yeah. Besides besides that type of, that type of food, I love I love seafood. Grew up eating, you know, crabs, oysters, shrimp, all that as a kid and still do. Love it, may not get it more often. But, and then another thing need to come across, don't, what, what's some um, little crab legs? They the, they the, I think it's colossal. Like they, they huge. Mm -hmm. Them real, real big crab legs. Big crab legs? Yeah, they. King crab? No, no, it's, it's king crab, but it's like colossal. King crab, like they're big, like. You had it? Mm. They they expensive. I mean, I know Amazon sells them like in a in a pack. Mm -hmm. That's how you know, cause some states don't have them, and then if they do have them, you you really have to go searching for them. I know they be selling them at Sam's Club and stuff. Sometimes. Well, it's king crab. Yeah. Okay. Um, where you from? And um. Are you a city person or a country person? Well, I'm from Maryland. Fourzil be exact. And I'm a city person, but I, I grew up in the in the country. Majority of the time, Carolinas and Georgia. So you know, I, I'm a city. Like I'm a city person. I don't like having to be you know. And the, you know, like the fields and stuff like that, and can't, you know, walk to the store, and you know, you're not close by a store or something, and it's just country. But I do like being in the country, you know, being on the fields, driving tractors. I do like that. But um, it's you drive tractor before? Yes. You have? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, I drove tractors, um, forklifts, drove a lot, lot of that stuff. Being in North Carolina, you know, helping, helping uncle, grandfather, you know, helping family members doing what you know, both what men do in the country. You know, um, picking, getting the hay from the field. Depending on the other side for the horses. Yeah, did a lot of stuff. Every time I went to North Carolina. So I did majority of the time. Okay. Um, I'm from, I was born in Washington, D.C. Um, so I live, I'm from the city. And actually, part of the city is Bitter Road, Heck Jamal. I went to Charles Young Elementary School and I was born in DC General. So, yeah, I'm from DC. And I worked in DC too as an adult in the government. And um, what I prefer is I don't prefer to live in a city because I don't like the fast paced life and I don't like bus stops being on every corner and I don't like congestion. So, or clutter. Um, overpopulation. I like everything to be spread out. And um, I like to see trees and grass and flowers. 
in the city you don't see that much grass and trees and stuff unless you go downtown where everything is like kind of um, more so for display for um, tourists and stuff like that so um yeah but I grew up in the city where there was a bus stop on every corner you can hear um, people talking all the time people walking past your bedroom you know not your bedroom but your window and you, hear, you always hear noise you know cars moving it, it was never quiet where so I we live in um, Charles County Maryland where it's a little bit more country where so it's like more space and grass and all that stuff when you open the window besides the emergency um, presentation fires the ambulance and police cars and stuff like that rolling by you can hear trees and birds and and all that stuff chirping. And I like that. I love that actually. What I don't like is the deer. Y'all can keep those, Charles County. Okay? I do not like the deer. My car got totally lost by a deer. <laughs> but whatever. I'm over it. But it still terrifies me at night when I drive. When I see these deers on the side of the road, oh my God, I lose it. Like, it's crazy. Like, it's nuts. Like, I'm thinking a deer gonna just run into the street. So, yeah. That's my whole thing about uh, country and city. Um, but I won't move back to the city. I'll visit, but I won't move back to the city. Yeah. Anything else you want to say about that? Okay. You have a question you want to ask? Mm. Why don't you just, mm, right off the top. No, really, think about it. What is your uh, favorite movie? Okay, top three. Top three? Yeah. Number one, Love and Basketball. Number two, after that. Hmm. Oh, what's that? Um, it can't be your favorite your number. I remember it. It was a thin line between was it love? Cause it yeah, Martin in it, Martin and what's her name? Len Len Whitfield. And it was like, you know, she was excuse me. These old old school movies, like nineties. It was like he was working at the club and they had Bobby Brown in it. Yeah, that's my that's my second. And then my third, my third is was house party all of them that's why I say in one house party all of them one two three yeah house party those those my top three do like a lot of action movies with top top three those three well <clears throat> he stole one of mine but whatever I used to deal with yes, those. you did. Love and Basketball is one of mine, so I'm not going to even throw that one out there for one of my top three. So you can go ahead and take that. Man. My one of my favorite movies is Brown Sugar. Um, I love, 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 love that movie, and I like to set it off. And I love um, one of my other favorite movies is. I reach down in my grab bag here. Um, because he stole mine, so whatever. Here, pick up. I'm going blank. Um, mm, okay. I guess I could say that, okay, I said love of basketball. I said brown sugar. And one of my other pa favorite pastimes to do is watch YouTube. So, um, I like watching YouTube, but it's not my favorite. It's not off topic with favorite movies but I do watch YouTube a lot and I am watching it's uh Netflix so if y'all got some movies on Netflix totally off subject that y'all watch and it's really really cool please let me know so I can go on there and see what's on there because I'm like to totally lost watching Netflix so yeah y'all give me some ideas in the comments down below what is a good movie to watch on Netflix um 
Elf. And if y'all have a favorite color or uh, your favorite food, hit it in the uh, description box down below, okay? So let us know what is your favorite food and your favorite color, okay? Why are we video creators for YouTube? Talking. Yes. <laughs> Go. Why? What? Why are we video creators on YouTube? Yeah, really. Why? Your turn. Really? No, you. I thought it was questions for both of them. You first. Because we're adventurers. We. We like, you know, like to have fun and like to, you know, talk, talk a lot, talk about, you know, certain sub our subjects and, you know, talking and relaxing, just talking about stuff that also with the, you know, with the girls, with our girls, have fun with, have fun with them and let them, you know, excuse me, all right guys, let them, you know, be be on the camera, have fun, have a good time, and, you know, laugh, giggle, joke, everybody open up and talk about certain topics and certain things. That's my, you know, why Saudi YouTube decided, you know, put that on camera, you know, pretty soon. Like people, people like to see things like that, you know, see what the kids on. It's a family channel. Mm -hmm. Everybody, you know, could watch. Kids, little, you know, little babies. That's why we had, had a, like I, one of our videos, the the worms and dirt video. Uh, cup of dirt. Cup of dirt. Like, that's, you know, that's for kids. Some for kids to do, have fun. In the house, you know, with the with the chocolate pudding and the gummy worms, that's something fun to do for the kids. We have, you know, more stuff coming. Just, you know, it's just a fun channel because we're we're fun people. Family, just fun. That's why I do, you know, our walks and yeah, just fun. A lot of fun. So decide. Put it on camera, let you guys see, let our fans and subscribers and supporters see, you know, yeah, it could be fun. Fun, 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 everybody have fun. Fun, fun. You can like about like 20 times. No. Um, why are we creators of YouTube? We created YouTube because, first of all, I always wanted to do YouTube, um, and it was an opportunity for us, especially since we're on and still in quarantine, um, so to speak. And it's something that we can do together. So um, uh, I'm glad we had the opportunity to do this. We also just got a ring light like a couple of days ago, so I'm excited about that. So we kind of traveling with our ring light, and everybody knows that when we come over, we're gonna be. Uh, doing some type of clip or something and they already know that we come you know to do something so some people to be like oh you coming over and you want to do something with us on your YouTube channel so yeah and every, a lot of people is excited that we're doing this you know because it's positive you know people like to see positive stuff um, and you know we can appreciate that creators cr content creators content uh, it's basically something that you watch and that you find very, very interesting that you want to watch over and 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 over again. So content is something that we definitely, um, we try to enhance upon and we uh, try to uh, make it better for you guys. And uh, we think that we think that we actually accomplishing those goals. Every day we have a goal, and we attempt to do that. We try to make a video every day of something, and um, that's 
something that has to do with our lives. We don't create content or create content that has nothing to do with us. So everything we do is pretty organic and stuff that we do um, to, so we can show us a little part, a little sneak peek of our life. So um, as my husband said, yes, we do a lot of walking. We do uh, hiking. Um, we like walking as our exercise. Um, and we like to travel. Um, and we like to have fun and learn different things and try out new foods and try out new things and just see where it goes from there. We just, we like to record. We like to have a good time. We like to be expressive. Oh, we were talking about today about wearing like costumes and stuff. I don't know what to wear, but I have no costumes. But um, maybe we can look into that. So if you want us to wear some different types of costumes and dress up a little bit, make it a little bit more interesting, let us know in the comments section down below, okay? So we uh, created, back to what I was saying, we created YouTube for the family, uh, for family that doesn't live close by, that will have a chance, the opportunity to see us. And they, all they can do is click on their phones and just say, whoo, okay, what is uh, Queen Sugar and King Bear doing? Oh, there they go, oh, they did that today. So we do have family that lives in different states that can't see us because we're quarantining and we make videos for everybody to see. Okay, and it's PG-13, definitely. We don't do anything that's not PG-13 um, because this is a family channel. So yes, we love to create content for you guys and we look forward to where this uh, YouTube platform will take us. Um, like I said, we do mukbangs, we do uh, reviews, restaurant reviews, we do pranks. We're gonna start doing more pranks for you guys. I think we did one on this channel. So, um, and just to see where that goes, okay? Um, next question. Do you want more kids? Do you want more kids? I said, do you? Yes, I, I want more kids, but it, it can wait because I'm just saying, you know, having having more kids, it's just like with with our daughters, you know, when when they're young and you know, three months, four months, five months, and they're you know, babies so you know, precious and beautiful, and just be like like a baby, you know, holding. Your baby in your arms and just those stages, but I understand you know have to grow up and grow and get older, learn new things and you know. So I mean, good with with our two. I mean, further down the line, years later, you know, plan it, out, plan it out and how many one, years and. One, that's on that's on you, cause it's not you know just. How many years are you expecting to wait? I'm saying if you know if plan it out and. So you say you want to have kids in your thirty? No, I said. <clears throat> cause you're gonna if, be thirty, so <coughs> two years from now I'll be. I I. Thirty five, thirty six. I said if if we plan it out and it happens, that you know if that's something. That we both want, because it's not, oh, I want kids and you don't want kids. We have to, you know, agree, and you know, that's what I say. Years later, you know, if we agree and want, you know, want to have, you know, another baby, then would that make you happy? I mean, it make us both happy, but you know, we have to be, because we're a team, so. I had to plan it out if we wanted to have further down the line. Do I want more kids? Not right now. No. We just got married, so only what, how many days? Today is Sunday, Monday. I'm married Monday. Six. Six days married. <laughs> No, I want more kids right now. I'm sorry. I want to travel. I want to see our kids get older and like be more independent. So we don't have to do as much. 
just more so chaperone or oversee to be more so hands <laughs> on with everything. Like, well, before we wake up, we have to cook everybody's food and breakfast and lunch and clothes and stuff. I want them to be able to do that stuff for themselves. Now, do I want to get a puppy or something? Yeah. I always wanted a dog. Do I want more kids? Maybe in the near future, I would like a boy. Because we got two girls. Um, physically, I don't think that would be a good idea. Well, could we adopt? Yeah. Um, but that is definitely a question. Hey, trying to meet a Siberian Husky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want a poodle. I want a black male poodle. That's what I want. Okay, next question. What is your favorite time of the day? Uh, afternoon, evening, afternoon, night. I'm not a big morning person. Okay. I'm a night person, but I notice I get up a lot in the morning to get stuff done, so I get tired quickly during the evening. Or I me mean, during the night time. Like after five, I be tired. So. I'm a night owl, but my schedule has changed when you have kids and stuff like that. You gotta get up early, can't sleep all day, because they, they need you to do things for them. That's why we just talk about the independence. Um, what college did you attend? I attended the University of the District of Columbia in the year 2007. Also went to Strayer University. I graduated from UDC and um, psychology, child psychology. Um, where I also joined um, my sorority, Sigma Gamma Rho Sorority Incorporated, Beta Chapter, UDC, Sprinkle 7, uh, Trade Club, and um, my line name was Lioness. Uh, I was number three on my line. So yeah, shout out to uh, Sigma Gamma Rho Sorority and the Beta Chapter at UDC, okay? Um, uh, as you grow for life, okay? Um, let's see. If you could travel anywhere, where would you go? Hmm. I would go to, Bo is that Bo Bo? I think that. Yeah, boy, boy, like, you know, it looks so, just so beautiful out there. You know, the water, the, you know, the community, you know, just down there, well, already up there. It's, you know, it's real nice. You know, the people, nice, you know, you have, wake up, wake up to that. You know, either lit, lit or vacation, feel good. Okay. Yeah. I want to travel all over the world, but I want to really go to Paris and Jamaica. And um, I want to go see Niagara Falls. So, yeah. Um, those are the places I want to go. Yeah, I do want to go to Paris and go to the Lock Bridge. Like we get a get a, a basically ways we we get a custom block and then we get something engraved on it and put it on the on a bridge and then because everybody some some people go down there and get married and then put the they names and stuff on the lock bridge and then it's just there there for you know so many years because. It's like, it's a gated, gated bridge and then you just put a lock on it. So, you know, with whichever type, whichever size lock, lock bridge. Want to go there one day? We go one day. We gotta get passports first. That's the process we were trying to start before all this happened three months ago. So, yeah, we're gonna get back on it once they open up everything. We have an application, so. Uh, we just gotta Maybe. get some some important um, information. We'll start the process on it. 
<coughs> excuse me. Um, so I'm excited about that. Um, getting a passport and then travel all over the world and getting that book stamp. Yes. Okay. So next question. What is the YouTube equipment that we use to produce content for the channel? Well, currently using using my phone, and that's been good. And then we what kind of phone do you have? Have a Galaxy S twenty five G. That's a current, you know, with all the all the videos. It was like we're currently used and just got a ring light a few days ago from Wan Wanu. It's from Amazon. It's spelled W O N E W. So just you know, type that in. It's an inexpensive ring light with the with the stand, and you could change the different settings. It's you know, it's affordable and does gets the job done. So what kind of um, software are we using to edit the videos? Where the the software you use is either on my phone or either on the on the computer on a computer Flamora Nine. That's a that's a good a good editing software. They have special effects and it's you know it's free unless you want you know extra stuff. But on, on my phone currently. That's what kind of what kind of software is on your phone? Do you? Since I had a Galaxy Galaxy S20, it's the Galaxy, you know, the video editor. Okay. It's a stock phone editor. What kind of equipment do we want to use in the near future to produce higher quality uh, videos? Quality videos. Well, as far as the camera, the camera would be a Canon, was it the EO, EO3? No, EOS. The EO, Canon EOS M, M7. Mm -hmm. That's the current camera, you know, trying to get. And then, and then also want to get, you know, just a effects and stuff, like a green screen. And you, you know, the most of them. So I think we're gonna try for the green screen next. Um, just to add one thing at a time, you know, so to speak. So, and then we're gonna just upgrade from there. Oh yeah, the Canon, yeah, the Canon camera, um, a, a roadie microphone. Yeah, the roadie microphone. And of course, uh, you know, a more, Better quality, you know, tr tripod. Even, even a um, what you call them, them, like the mini spider tri tripods. You know, cause we're gonna be vlogging too, so you know, not can't carry this everywhere. That's you know, future equipment. And maybe get an Apple computer for uh, editing and all of those stuff to go with the Canon. Uh, camera so I think one step at a time of course you know everything all equipment costs uh, money and um, as we go on and on you got to show us more support and we definitely will start making those type of purchases right now we use what we got so uh, we get up these subscribers up to a thousand we get this uh, 5,000 watch time we start making money on here then maybe we can start getting better equipment and um, produce a better quality uh, videos for you guys. But we definitely gonna still hit you with these beggars and we're gonna um, show you a little bit of glimpse of our life and what we do every day. Okay. Um, what is your favorite ice cream? Mm. I like strawberry, but the Ben and Jerry's. Mm -hmm. What is that when I had it? Ben and Jerry's. I can't see Ben and Jerry's ice cream. They have crazy names for the ice cream. That's why I can't think of it. 
it was like it was like strawberry strawberry because strawberry is my favorite ice cream but that specific one i had it when i went to ben, ben and jerry's store it's so good i had to go back twice and get some more so that's that's my favorite ice cream strawberry Okay, I'm not close to tolerant, but I be pushing it sometimes. <laughs> so, um, I like, what do you call it, pecan. So I'll get like ice cream, but that's pecan ice cream. Or I like chocolate, and I definitely like caramel. So, caramel sundae or something like that. But it's very rare. I won't go to the store every day and buy it. And it's, you know, I do buy ice cream sandwiches for the kids, but I'm not gonna buy um, ice cream every day because I'm lactose tolerant. And I don't drink milk. So, which means I don't eat cereal in the morning, but I eat it dry. So, what's your favorite cereal? <laughs> favorite cereal? Hmm. Because I have a top three. But, let me see. First one, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Even a chocolate Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Oh my God. And then second, second Frosted Flakes. And then after that will be, it's like Cabin, Cabin Crunch. Yeah, Cabin Crunch. So those are my three favorite. Okay. That's cool. I don't have no favorite cereal because I don't eat it. But I do like shredded wheat or granola cereal where I can eat it dry. Um, or uh, Raisin Bread Crunch. Okay. Um, guys, if y'all have any videos that y'all want to see next, hit it in the, uh, down in the comment section down below so we can um, definitely come out with some food challenges that you want to see. We're going to start incorporating other people into the videos as we start traveling and um just try to do some different adventurous type of things next we're going to do the um walmart uh seven items in seven minutes i've seen that on um uh, youtuber so i'm definitely going to check them out um we have some uh people that we're going to see who are your uh, inspirational youtubers that you have that you watch as you say okay I want to be just like them, or I want to do content like them, or when I, hopefully our channel, when our channel grows, hopefully we can do something similar to them, or who gives you motivation on YouTube to keep going? Let's get it. Well, Pretty Boy Fredo. Who? Pretty Boy Fredo. A lot of umbrage of some of some of y'all know Pretty Boy Fredo, and also Jasmine Two Times, with a Two Times family. Fredo, Jasmine, Ava, they, you know, cause outside, on the downside, they, you know, they show love and support to their supporters, and then give, you know, motivational stuff, like, you know, put your mind in how to, you could do it. It was like, don't matter how many, you know, followers, subscribers you had anywhere, put the work in, you won't make it, and you won't, you won't get what you need to get. He actually, you know, him and Jasmine, they gave good motivation. That's, that's who I look at to in that. Besides, yeah, besides, I mean, yeah, pretty boy Fredo. Mm -hmm. The pretty boy Fredo. Uh, let me see. Uh, yeah, SSH gang. That's that's basically pretty boy Fredo. But you know, everybody in his you know group, they you know show love, support everybody. You know, do giveaways, do you know just. Do stuff. Good look at you know one of his videos. He he has he has a guy as a guy you know was like basically give him give give you fifty thousand dollars quit your job today. 
<laughs> you know, it seemed wild, but it was like, you got $50,000 in cash. Somebody come to you, it's like, you know, you, so we did, you know, got them a whole makeover, new clothes, haircut, you know, they ain't had $50,000. That's, you know, just somebody, somebody random, just, you know, and uh, cause you, when you, when you make it big like that and you go to a certain restaurant and you see somebody putting their hard work in and you know you got it, you gonna do what you can, you know, to help. And show them, you know, like, yeah, you pay all this hard work in, but it was like, keep doing it, keep on pushing, but also, you know, you gonna show your love or support. So that was Fredo showing his love and support. He always doing something like that, you know, give away cars and that's why he, you know, Cause I'm like, okay, when we make it big like that, you know, we like to do that. You know, okay. even even for kids, like do stuff at, you know, daycare or, you know, schools. And that's why I'm pretty worried right now. Wow. I just did a whole thesis <laughs> of nonsense of, uh, of pretty boy Fredo. Yeah, I like Pretty Boy Fredo too. He's pretty cool. I like him. His family. They've been through a lot and they finally came back together at the end. So I've been watching him for a while. So I feel him on that. Now I won't elaborate such on one person, but yeah. Um, the couples that I like is. Da, 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 da. I used to. <clears throat> I follow the Prince family. Um, I followed uh, the Johnson family, which is Nick and King. I followed the uh, I followed P R P R G. Is it P R G? Is it P R G? Make sure I say it correctly. P R gang. P R gang, and which is slash Chrissy P. Um, they have some interesting things on there. They do a lot of mukbangs and stuff like that. Um, I follow them. I follow, let's say Naya and Jalen. I follow them. Um, they're pretty much young couples with people of that age and um, they do different things and stuff like that on their channels. They have multiple channels actually. And a lot of their ch channels are up in the millions, which we plan to get there soon. Uh, maybe in the next 12 months. We just started, we already did a month already. Um, also like the Sands family. Yes, I like the Sands family. And um, I watch them as well. Uh, I like Yummy Bites. And I love B Loves Life. Uh, I love her uh, mukbangs and stuff like that. B Loves Life. Yes, she's pretty cool. Um, she's a Christian and she believes, she has her own um, beliefs and she likes her family. Um, Zaddy Shong Chunk and his girlfriend, Nicole, of course. And then you have Darius and then the man of the house. So. As you can see, I know a lot. <laughs> um, so I do watch YouTube when I'm not doing, uh, on my spare time. Um, so if you have a YouTube channel, leave it in uh, the comment uh, the comments down below and I'll definitely go check you guys out and I'll uh, go over there and support you. Hit the like button, subscribe, bell to be notified and comment in the comment section. Yeah, I'll be there. Um, and I love Lovely Mimi. Lovely Mimi is from DC. Um, y'all know her. She's so funny. Okay. Lovely Mimi. She does, she does nails. So, and she has her own little show and stuff like that too. She's mm -hmm. always up, she's almost up to a million too, by the way. So y'all go support Lovely Mimi. Yeah, everybody knows Lovely Mimi. Remember, she was on Love and Hip Hop. Yeah, she's a Love and Hip Hop. Yep. Yep, thanks. Um... So those are just a few people that we go see. And I, and I also follow uh, Liv's Life, um, L-I-V-S Life. Um, I follow her and her family. Um, uh, I like her channel because she keeps it real and she has, you know, um, some similarities. So I follow her as well, okay? Um, so those are a few. We have met some a lot of YouTubers along the way, so which is cool. Um, 
that I'm excited about. Um, hopefully we get to meet him one day. And um, I like to do some collabs. I've never done a collab before. So I want to do one of those, see how it is. I know a lot of people don't like to do the don't like to do collabs for whatever reason, but I like to make my own observations. So um, see how that goes. Let's see. I'm trying to go on here and see if I can find Kayla and Jade. Yes, Kayla and Jade. K L. Why? I'm sorry, KL. Ugh. <laughs> Why well, we're getting tongue tied today? Okay, so is Kayla and Jade. Okay, Kayla and Jade, they have their own YouTube channel. Thank you so much, Kayla and Jade. Um, they always come to our. Uh, no, Ka Kayla and Jade. What? K Y L A. It, look. Jade, make sure y'all guys, um, y'all go hit their uh, bell. Uh, they're gonna comment down in our comment section or like our channel and stuff like that. So um, if y'all go on, on on YouTube, hit the search engine, type in K Y L A, the N symbol, and J A E E. Y'all go check them out. They are very, very, very nice uh, couple, and they're always on here supporting us. And they always comment in our comment section and they're liking our page and they actually watch our video. So we go and watch theirs as well. So that is a loyal subscriber. So make sure that we want we want a lot of those and as well as they want a lot of uh, loyal subscribers. If y'all are loyal subscribers to us and we see that you taking the time out of your time to comment in our comment section and liking our page and having some type of input to our channel because it's not easy to produce content. It's not easy to edit videos and it's not easy, some people who are camera shy, like my husband, to sit up here and actually talk to you guys and try to bring some type of livelihood to your life. You know, so, but we enjoy doing it and um, we are working on getting a better in the situation, but um, we respect people who respect us and they, the J family, Kaylee and Jay family, they have been commenting on every video. And my husband counted today. We have 36 videos thus far in a month and a half. So we're doing pretty good. You know, we're producing one video or two videos in a day. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys. Make sure y'all go like their page, subscribe to their page, and leave a comment down below. And make sure y'all keep up and be a loyal subscriber to them. So shout out to them. I appreciate y'all. Um, if you want to join the Kings and Queen family, make sure you hit that subscription box. Okay? Subscribe, 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 subscribe. Okay? Make sure you subscribe. Okay? Make sure you watch the video to its entirety so you can, we can get that subscription. Because I noticed that YouTube, if you just hit the subscribe button and you just move on, they think that's subscribe from us. Okay, so kings and queens, please make sure y'all watch our videos and y'all subscribe so they can um, identify you as a loyal subscriber so you could join our kings and queens family, okay? And make sure y'all always comment down below. So when y'all see, if you hit the bell button, you will win. Every time you go on YouTube, if you're a YouTube person, even if you're not a YouTuber, you're a YouTube person, and you get on YouTube and you see uh, Queen Sugar and King Bear up there in your timeline, boop, hit the, hit the, uh, Hit the picture and watch the video and comment, okay? And we'll definitely do this well to you if you have a YouTube channel, okay? Um, those are all the questions that we have today. I hope you really, really enjoy this video. We had a good, good time with you guys. As always, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe and hit that bell to be notified so we can make sure we come back to you so any person that comments on our video we're going to give you a shout out in the next video okay so make sure you comment down the comment section don't just view and don't like come on view like subscribe and comment okay in that order in that order in that order in that order okay so what you do you view you like you subscribe then you comment down below, okay? 
So, if you comment down below and we see you in three or more videos, comment on our videos, we're going to give you a shout out in the next video. I promise, okay? Queen Sugar promise you that we're going to shout you out, okay? Other than that, honey, do you have anything else to say? No, that, like, like Queen Sugar said, like, comment, subscribe, watch the videos, you know, show love and support. We appreciate it. All right, so make sure y'all join the Queen and King family, and make sure y'all hit that like button, okay? All right, and make sure y'all subscribe and hit that bing bell to be notified. And we're going to see y'all in the next, next video.